Here in Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight Mumbai, we are treating this problem since 2004. I show one month sample of each. After 22 days of the treatment, a remarkable change had come in the field test. Patient could see the lights in the room. That's it. After six months of a degraded treatment in Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight Mumbai, she started getting a ton of vision here. It can be very well seen. After one year, a tremendous improvement had come. Now she comes independently for follow-ups. What are the treatment of this problem? I am Dr. Goel, speaking from Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight Mumbai. We will talk today about the treatment of this problem. Retinitis pigmentosa is a genetic degenerative retinal disease which causes degeneration of the retinal cells and reduction of vision each and every day in this disease. One in 4,000 persons are suffering with this disease. Very important issue of the society. Here in Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight Mumbai, we are treating this problem since 2004. People are coming from all over the world for the treatment, doctors and non-medical people also. Doctor is also a human being. As other human beings suffer with any problem, he also suffer, he or she also suffer with the same problems. And improvement I have seen in each and every case. Why people improve over here? Because the whole retinal cells are not dystrophied. In initial stages, till the vision loss is complete, is not completed. Certain cells are lying in the retina which are not actively working also, we are not dystrophied completely also. These cells may be called as weak cells or dormant cells. We activate these dormant cells by our integrated method so they take care of their own work and the neighboring cells work also which we see the improvement by perimetrics, field test, which is the very important and common test in case of retinitis pigmentosa. In the last, when I conclude, I will show some reports of the patient's cells. So, the important issue of this disease is to hold the deterioration of the vision and from there to improve. One bad thing in this disease is there is no cure of this disease because it's a genetic problem. Mostly it is hereditary. 50% of the cases they have family history. Other 50% of cases either mutation or abnormal distribution of the genes when we see that here is structure. But it is genetic. So this will not go from the gene that till the person is alive. But treatment is possible. The people who become dependent on other people they can't take their own uh, daily routine work and there are a lot of problems they start uh, feeling after this or they are, uh, they are really getting a trouble in the normal routine life that should be prevented which can be done here in Sanjeev for perfect eyesight Mumbai. So this is treatable but not curable. But if person can improve a lot in the vision what problem is facing today, if it can be avoided, it can be prevented, it can be taken care of, then they get multiple reliefs in their life. As we know, the symptom of this disease is problem in the darkness, the vision in the darkness, movement in the darkness, coming down from the step, the depth perception get affected. Any light comes from the eyes, they can't tolerate it, the eyes is a photophobia, peripheral vision loss they have a peripheral vision loss. To prevent that, we can prevent the tunnel disease, tunnel vision and to improve the tunnel from opposite side, ablate to the opposite side, which is coming towards the center, let the tunnel go, become big, 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 big. So we can do that by one integrated methods. Now what integrated methods we use here? Symptoms in detail and about the retinitis pigmentosa we have talked in previous videos also. I talk in other videos also. Today, 
is a very important issue. What is the treatment of this problem? This is such a unwanted guest. Like there are so many guests in the life who comes to our family which no one likes them, but they require a real attention. Then only they are satisfied. This this disease is like a very unwanted guest in their life require a full attention. Then only improvement can be seen. Means so many therapies required for the treatment. Not a single therapy affects very well. No allopathy, no homeopathy, no arbitrary, no organ, no human. Talks of this disease very well. Here what we use in integrative method, I'll first name them and I'll detail them. Name wise, first is vision therapy, second is microcurrent stimulation, third is electroacupuncture, fourth is natural nutritional supplement, fifth is nutrition with nutritionist, sixth is psychological counseling, and then last antioxidant treatment. Vision therapy. Vision therapy is a scientific eye, scientific and specific eye exercises, which means so many different different activities in front of nature without the machines. For example, some activities in front of sun. If sun is not there in front of natural light, if natural light is not there in front of artificial light, then in front of charts, in front of swing, in front of candle, big ball, bead, the very vast subject of vision therapy. These vision therapy can't be called as eye exercises because Typical eye exercise means look up, look down, look left, look right, look clockwise, look anti-clockwise. They are eye exercises which are very bad for the eye because they are strenuous. Vision therapy is relaxing. They relax the whole eye apparatus means eye, nerve and brain. They relax the whole system. And then they do vision. Vision therapy is a very, very important, important thing which we provide here. And they are all specialized individuals and personal. They are not same for everybody. If we take 10 RP cases, their treatment may not, may not remain the same. So they specialize individual and personalized. So first part is vision therapy. Second is microcurrent stimulator. <coughs> or I should say microcurrent stimulation. There is one machine called a microcurrent stimulator that gives a different type of vibrations to the eyes, to the retina to be applied outside. It's not invisible process from outside. These vibrations helps in making the retina vibrant, increase the circulation of the retina, make the retina healthy. They help in dislodging the pigment from the retina. Very important work. Third, electroacupuncture. What is electroacupuncture? Every organ of the body has points on the surface of the body. If you press that point with the thumb, it is called as acupressure. If we put a very fine needle, there are special needles for acupuncture. They are sterile, very fine like hair. They don't pain. If we put that needle on that point, it is called as acupuncture as you are puncturing the point. If we connect two electrodes, to two needles and pass the electric stimulation called as electroacupuncture, which is the most advanced way of treating any body problem and their particular subject. There are thousands and thousands of points are there in the body. Which point to connect to which point? What angle should be there of the needle? How much electric stimulation should be given? That is the specialization. And we have the specialists for that in Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight, Mumbai. So around the eyes, not in the eyes, around the eyes, hand below elbow, leg below knee, certain points are there to be stimulated for some time. They help very well in case of retinal pigmentosa. They again increase the circulation of the retina. They make the retina vibrant. They make the retina healthy. They help in dislodging the pigment from the retina. Ultimately, patients get improvement in the vision. Next, natural nutritional supplements. There are not many natural nutritional supplements are coming in the market internationally which are not medicine. They are not whey protein and all like. They are like juice, dry fruits, omega 3, omega 9. There are so many, so many unnatural nutritional supplements are available in the market 
internationally, which can be advised according to the need. It is not compulsory. Every patient should be advised the same thing. They are, but they are direct from nature. Anybody in the family can take, and they are not at all any medicine. They are not medicine, allopathy, homeopathy, garvedi, kundalini. They are not medicine. They are completely, completely derived from nature. They are called as natural medicine supplement. They again is a specialized, individualized, personalized. We advise natural medicine supplement to be continued along with vision therapy, which helps a lot in improving or recovering the vision. Then nutrition with nutritionist. We have a very good uh, nutritionist over here that takes the interview of the person, lifestyle, food habits, what are the food habits they have. So from their food only, she tried to advise nutrition or diet from their food only, which is good for the eyes. Psychological counseling. Because this disease is a bad disease. The person goes all over the world for uh, consultations and they get the same answer, the research is going on. They talk about the stem cells, they talk about gene therapy, they talk about so many things, but results are not there much and they are confused, they are depressed. Some people develop the suicidal tendencies and so many downfalls in the life. So in the back of the mind, they are not very comfortable. To support them, Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight has a department of psychology. They give a psychological counseling that helps a lot to make their life smooth. Then, antioxidant treatment. Antioxidants are there, which are like vitamins. They are good for the eyes, for depigmentation. They stop the objective degeneration of the cones also. They come in the form of injections and tablets. According to the requirement, injections are also in the intramuscular injection, in the back, how we take the normal injection, not in the eyes. So the everybody is advisable then we give them or we advise them the injection on the gluteal region on the back how we take the normal injection one or two injection in four months and then uh, we advise them on the tablet form. So this is the combination of the treatment being provided in Sanjeevan for perfect I said for RP cases. So to summarize them, vision therapy, microcurrent stimulation, electroacupuncture. Natural nutrition supplement, nutrition with nutritionist, psychological counseling, and antioxidant treatment. This gives it a wonderful and fantastic improvement in the cases of retinitis pigmentosa. But person will improve that much how much dormant cell he has. And there is no machine yet come till now to calculate the dormant cell from outside. When we start the treatment, then only we come to know how many dormant cells he has. I will show few sample reports to show you the improvement by integrated methods in Sanjeevan for Perfect Eyesight, Mumbai. Retinitis pigmentosa is either typical, where the periphery loss of vision is more than the central loss, center is clear and periphery is bad, or atypical. When the center and periphery both are involved, or severe form where the vision goes very badly, only the light perception is there. I show one one sample of each, which has improved by indicated methods here in Sanjeevan. This person's report, the perimetry is the best answer to see the progress or to see the improvement in this disease. Generally, we do ERG, electroretinogram, or perimetry. They are two very informative tools to know the level of deterioration or level of improvement in retinal pigmentosa. Field test or perimetry is very very good test to tell us immediately the improvement or deterioration in the retinal status. Now this is the board of typical RP where the periphery is bad and center is better. If you can see 10th June, this report is there. And after treatment of 22 days, in the 2nd July, the difference between two reports, I'll show you. The black part, as I said in previous video, is a bad part, where the person could not see from this area. Brown is better than black, they can see, but very minimal, not normal. 
green is better than brown they can see better than brown area right but not normal yellow is better than green but not normal but better than green white is the best if we take this report of a person who is not having retinal dystrophy they will have full white report <coughs> after 10 june after 22 days of the treatment a remarkable change had come in the field test the tunnel which was very small started becoming big you can see that the down area which were completely black there was no vision in this side started getting a tunnel vision from here this is starting a tunnel of vision here this is only 22 days treatment is still goes on so this is the typical rp now i will show you a typical rp other report this is a typical rp report where the center and periphery both are involved there is no tunnel this is report of 15th of the month and this is 30th of the month treatment of 2 weeks only when the person came he was having this type of perimetry where the black is bad brown is better than black green is better than brown yellow is better than better than green and white is the best which is very small white in this report after 15 days of the treatment see the periphery started better we are getting clear if you can notice there so many white areas that come this person was having a color vision problem also one of the symptom of the disease and this was also corrected and he place he got a very good placement and very good company in india so this is a treatment of 15 days only so much clearance is there so treatment is go on goes on the defective part is started sinking and clearance is started from periphery so this was a typical rp now i will show you the worst report of the rp this is very bad report of rp one patient who came in sanjeevan for perfect eyes at mumbai was having this report which was completely black the vision was that much only light perception patient could see the lights in the room that's it she came with the support of somebody else they kept holding the hand and they brought in the consultant after 6 months of a dignity treatment in sanjeevan for perfect eyes in mumbai she started getting she started getting a tunnel of vision here which can be very well seen in this perimetry after one year a tremendous improvement had come now she comes independently for follow ups from this status to this status coming in the hell of the difference hell of the difference is a beautiful difference in the patient vision she was she was dependent she became independent now she comes alone for the follow ups still treatment is going on our try will be there to clear more this right now because white area area started coming in this area this patch we want this more so this was the report of a person who was having very bad vision only light perception was there the minimum requirement of sanjeevan for perfect eyes is for vision improvement is light perception in any of the eye problem if somebody has light perception only they are also liable for improvement perfect eyes set patients suffering with retinal pigmentation but i have seen with my experience since 2004 i am this is this is 2004 treating thousands and thousands of patients from all over the world for different different eye problems if the person can consistently follow the system follow the therapies and follow the uh, good habits and uh, instructions given from here they can maintain their vision they can hold their deterioration of the vision and they can improve vision from there that much i will talk in this video next we will see in the next video for different different topics any question any query you want to contact us you can contact from the details described thank you you can contact on 932440702 you can visit our site www.sanjeevan.in or you can contact us on or mail us on info@sanjeevan.in